Are you ready to embark on a journey that will change how you think about gaming and crypto? Crypto Raiders is an epic adventure waiting for you. This game is a blend of pixel dungeon crawler, RPG, and DeFi elements that will leave you hooked. With the power of Polygon Network and NFTs, you'll loot dungeons, defeat bosses, and earn tokens you can hold in your digital wallet. And so, this is not just a game, but it's a gateway to the exciting world of blockchain gaming. So, if the idea of a game that combines pixel dungeon crawling, RPG, and DeFi elements sounds intriguing to you, make sure to watch this video till the end. Welcome back, Metaverse Monopolists. I'm not a financial advisor. This video exists solely for educational entertainment. Please make your own researched financial decisions. Now, in this game, you can raid dungeons to boost your character's powers by gaining experience points and acquiring new equipment. And by completing quests, you can also earn valuable crafting materials. In addition, you can own mobs in dungeons and steal other players' currencies and items. Finally, you can mint new raiders to join your team. And the game is a simulation of your character fighting enemies in the metaverse. Again, the game is a simulation of battles in a virtual world where players control the character and fight against virtual enemies using skills and equipment. But before diving into the game's features such as gameplay, tokenomics, and more, please take a moment to show your support by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. Now, to get started, you'll need to grab yourself a raider. These can be found on OpenSea and can be bought using ETH. Prices for raiders start at around 0.1 ETH, or about 300 USD. Over time, raider recruitment events will be held to bring in more characters and make it easier for new players to join in. And keep in mind that raiders come with different attributes and characteristics that can affect their abilities and price. Each raider also has a race, generation, level, and gear that can be viewed in the raider's description on OpenSea. Moreover, gear is crucial for battling dungeons so you can buy a raider that's already equipped or earn gear through raids. As you play, you can earn Arum by completing dungeons and quests. The harder the task, the more Arum tokens you'll earn. But don't forget that the higher level dungeons also allow you to get better gear and XP. Plus, if you use a certain NFT character, you'll get an extra bonus percentage. One thing to keep in mind about Crypto Raiders is that it has a permadeath feature. If your character dies in the game, it's gone for good. Now, after you've finished your weekly raids, you might wonder what other features Crypto Raiders offers. You can check your characters and in-game assets on the website. And you can also recruit new characters and invest in the Raider token. Plus, you can own NFT characters called mobs. These are the player-controlled enemies that you'll find in every dungeon. Moreover, if your mob defeats a Crypto Raider, you'll get a share of their gear and Arum tokens. And just like raiders, mobs can be bought on the OpenSea marketplace. Do you think crypto gaming is awesome? If so, be sure to check out our favorite crypto gaming ecosystem using the link in the description. Crypto Raiders has two types of tokens, Raider and Arum. The Raider token represents the overall economy of the platform, and holders of this token will receive a share of all revenue generated through in-game purchases and activities. On the other hand, the Arum is the in-game currency. You can earn Arum rewards by successfully completing dungeons or having your mobs defeat other Raiders. Additionally, players can stake their Raider tokens to earn Arum. The total supply of Crypto Raider tokens is 100 million, with a market cap of around 31 million. The coin currently ranks number 3,237 by market capitalization. Recently, the gaming industry has seen a rise in blockchain games. These games are being developed and launched quickly, and Crypto Raiders is one of the latest games that has gained much attention. Its DeFi elements, play-to-earn mechanics, and engaging gameplay might be the reasons for its popularity. So, if you're new to the world of NFT gaming and looking for a good starting point, Crypto Raiders is a great option to consider. So, what are your thoughts on this new P2E NFT game? Let me know in the comments section below. Additionally, there's a new virtual reality game that I think you'll like. I'm talking about Galaxy Arena, which offers a unique, decentralized experience with various activities. So, if you want to know more about this new game, then just tap the tab to learn more about it, and we'll see you inside the metaverse.